Hello, today I want to explain in this tutorial how to use coordinates from OpenStreetMap in R. For example, to measure distances to a point of interest or to calculate the number of points of interest in a certain radius. A point of interest can be anything in OpenStreetMap. Schools, cinemas, stores, train stations or traffic lights. For this example we take traffic lights. You can find a list of all categories on this page. You can find the link in the video description. We use the OSM data package. If you have installed this package and want to use it, don't forget to quote it. With site OSM data you could get a citation in BibTeX format. My tutorial is based on a tutorial from this website, written by Dr. Dominic Roy. But in my tutorial I want to go less into the aspect of how we fill a map with OSM data, but how we use the coordinates for calculations. You can also find the link to his tutorial in the video description. If you have installed all necessary packages, we define in a string which city you choose. I choose Berlin. I also save the coordinates of a point at the Brandenburg Gate. You can copy the coordinates on Google Maps with a right click, or you can use another data source. In the next step, we request data from OpenStreetMap using the Overpass API. We look for the data from Berlin, which fulfilled the conditions highway is equal to traffic signals. So we get all traffic signals drawn on OpenStreetMap and convert this data into a simple features format. This format can contain OSM points, lines, polygons and more. Since we are dealing with traffic lights, we are only interested in the points. Their coordinates are stored under the category Geometry. Now let's create an array for all the traffic lights we find. In this array we want to calculate the distances from our point at the Brandenburg Gate to the respective traffic light. We do this in a for loop. In the for loop we use a function distm. This function is used to calculate the distance between two points with GPS coordinates. There we use our coordinates at the Brandenburg gate and the coordinates of the respective traffic light of the array. After that we can find the nearest traffic light by the minimum function. The closest a traffic light is only 20 and 3 meters away. We can also find the number of all traffic lights within a radius of 1 kilometer. This is uh, 129 traffic lights. For example, in my current master thesis I am analyzing the data from bicycle counting stations. I use data about traffic lights near the counting stations as shown here but also from schools, universities and bus stops to predict the traffic of bikes at each counting station. Finally, I want to check if our selected point is on one of the main roads surrounding the Brandenburg gate. To do this we create a new query. This time we look for primary highways. And this time we don't need the coordinates of a point but the coordinates of lines since we are now using the data of a road network. To calculate the distance of a point to a line we use the function stDistance. For this the point and the line must use the same coordinate reference system. So we adjust both to each other. After that we can get the shortest distance. According to this our point is almost 30 meters away from a main road. Since I don't think a main road is that wide, our point is not on a main road. I hope I could help you with this or give you some ideas on how you want to use OpenStreetMap data in R. Don't forget to like this video and feel free to subscribe to my channel.